right, coming up next, a UFC featherweight division fight. about as decorated a kickboxer as has come into this division in some time, DC. And if we get a kickboxing match tonight, he ain't losing. He is a championship-level kickboxer, a guy that can stand in the pocket and trade and kick and punch with anyone. He's constantly throwing things from as close as you can get. He's comfortable throwing leg kicks. He will drive these into your body. But it's the aggressiveness and the ability and willingness to stand in the pocket and trade that makes him truly, truly special. I think that is what separates kickboxing, the high level yeah. from everyone else. He understands distance as well as any striker in this division. Of course, that is a byproduct of a lifetime of repetitions in the kickboxing space. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times. Enter Bruce Lee. I mean, that's Bruce Lee in a nutshell. Over and over and over, he did the same thing, and it shows in the technique because there's no wasted energy. There's no wasted movements. Everything he does, he does with a purpose. He goes in there with an idea of what he's trying to accomplish, and he gets it done. Bruce Lee is the absolute best. Bruce Lee is the man. His grappling, his takedown defense figure to be tested here tonight. But there aren't that many guys who are going to want to stand and trade on a napkin in the center of the octagon with the great Bruce Lee. No, if you're fighting Bruce Lee, you're shooting for takedowns right yeah. away. Or tail the tape for this featherweight fight. So these fighters relatively close in age, just a year apart, with similar height and some differences in reach. Here is Bruce Lee. Ladies Buck. and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Dan Mergliata. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out Madison Square Garden Arena in New York City. <laughs> Featherweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet five inches tall, weighing in at 140 pounds. Fighting out of Shanghai, China, Assassin. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting out of Los Angeles, California, USA, Bruce the Dragon Lee! All right, get the rules in the locker room. I want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. I want a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, back your corner, come out there. You ready? You ready? Let's go, guys. Well, the tension is palpable as this fight gets underway, and it's going to be interesting to see how this matchup plays out. All right, here we go. First round is underway. No denying the big reach advantage for him tonight. We'll see if he can get that jab going early. Look for him to circle on the outside. Use that long jab to keep his distance and only engage on his terms. Big punch lands over the top. How's he going to follow this one up? Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Nice. Oh, beautiful counter jab upstairs for him there. He's got the reach advantage, and that certainly helped him in that exchange. Nice knee to the midsection there.
Unable to connect with the right hand there. Nice body. Switching stances here. Game of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Just missed on the front kick there. Big power punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Trying to go to the body here. Unable to find the target. Just over two minutes to go. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Oh, massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. With 90 seconds to go in round one. Nice defense there, huge block. Nice punch, man. Gonna land the leg kick now. Head kick attempt, but the fighter got the right hand up. 15 seconds. Horn sounds for the end of round one. All right, let's take a look back at some of the replays from that last round. Unbelievable to see these high-level competitors get in each other's face, tuck their chin, bite down on the mouth guard, and just let it all hang out over the course of five minutes. Take a seat. Deep breath. Breathe. Take a drink. All right, here we go. Listen. You're doing absolutely awesome. Watch it. All right, round two. Lee gets hit by that kick to the body. Nice strike. Oh, and he caught the kick. Oh, body kick attempt here is no good. There's no tell on that leg kick. He's going after the head. There it is. Take the shot now. Take the shot. There it is. Well, he's got the reach advantage. You might as well use it. Nice job there to find a home for that jab. And he landed the right hand there. Good night if that landed. He has a commitment to kick it tonight, and it shows. All right, so he's landed some good shots tonight, but this is not a combo meal, right? No three-piece, uh, no soda. It's one and done more often than not. John, don't you come to me without a combo. I want the whole platter. Give him the whole platter, young man. Put some punches together. Make this guy take the whole thing. Give him more than one strike. You have now found a set of punch. The jab is landing consistently. Find something that's gonna go behind it. Let it go now. Just unable to quite find that range. His hands are down. Let's set up that high kick now. Trying to do damage now with the kick. That's a miss. Well, he's really picked up the pace here in round two. Much more aggressive now here and starting to find himself in the pocket. Big punch lands through the middle. Punch coming, it's blocked. Hip 
over when he throws that kick. Trying to establish that jab once again. And he lands the knee to the body now. 15 seconds remain in the round. Ten minutes in the books. All right, let's take a look back at some of the highlights from those previous five minutes, DC, and uh, no padding, no glove on that foot. No glove, no padding, and look at the hip action when he throws those kicks. He's not only kicking just for feel, he's really trying to damage his opponent, and as the fight goes longer, you will start to see it taking effect. You ready? You ready? Let's go, fight! So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Well, he continues to find the openings tonight. Beautiful connection with a the punch there. Accuracy at its best. Well, we told you off the top he had the reach advantage, and you saw it right there with that punch. All right, lands a kick there. Pretty well done. Really good accuracy landing that kick. He lands flush with that right hand. Good job keeping that head off the center line. Slips to avoid the right hand. Nice straight punch. Oh! Huge kick to the head. Muay Thai plump. Oh, another strike to the body. Not a lot of real estate there, but he found it. by this young man. He does a great job of disguising that technique. And before you know it, boom, he lands. It's okay, keep going. Out of range with that kick attempt. Keep moving. Oh, nice. Going for the body, missed with that kick. Nice head kick. Ooh, what a punch. 30 seconds now to go in the round. Oh, he's got that right hand going tonight, DC. Connected with it there. He's thrown so many left jabs to throw that right punch straight down the pipe. It's unreal. Right, three rounds in the can. We're headed to the championship round. All right, so there is the horn at times in that previous round. I didn't think we'd get here after that head kick nearly had him out of there. It was a good round leading up to that. But when you take a head kick like that, when your opponent gets your entire body into that kick, usually the night's over. Very tough to still be standing, but he can't take many more like that. All right, the action continues here and now as our next round gets underway. The previous round won't be confused for a round of the year, but pretty good action. It was a pretty good round. Not every round is going to have you standing up out of your seat. Understand that you are watching the highest level of fighting in the entire world in the UFC. What a punch. Oh, beautifully timed with the Superman punch.
Well, that body kick was there earlier, not there on that attempt. Nice leg kick lands. Lee's head kick looked like that one was blocked. Nice kick. Keep your hands up. Oh, nice. Just out of range with that left hook. Well, you didn't see a lot of the body work from him in the earlier rounds, but he's certainly getting after it here. Big shot to the body connects there. We'll see if he can follow it up. Look at the force behind that leg kick. Oh, man. That, you jumped out of your seat a little bit after that kick. Oh, I did because I have a time where I've been kicked like that. And I'm going to tell you one thing. It does not feel good. part of himself into these big leg kicks. Oh, lands that punch. Well, it's all pace and pressure down the stretch. He is really lighting them up now. Oh, that's a good right hand. 90 seconds to go now. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. He's hurt bad. Oh, nice straight punch there. Must be nice to have a reach advantage like this, DC. Oh! And they separate. Try to establish that jab. Ooh, big shot lands. Roundhouse now just misses. 20 minutes down, potentially five to go. All right, let's get you a replay from that previous round. It was the big knockdown courtesy of that kick that, that nearly closed the show for good. It almost closed the show, but nothing's more discouraging than when you get somebody hurt that bad and you don't shut the door. He has to go back to work now knowing that he's got about as tough a guy as, if, as he's ever had in front of him in the octagon tonight. Continues to land a high number of strikes here, just like he did in the previous round. This is a world-class display of striking here tonight. Big head kick lands. Well done to catch the kick. We'll see what he can do. Oh, nice job to block the kick. Inches right there, yeah. boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Big kick. Down the stretch they come. We're going down to the wire. It has been all action all the time. I mean, two evenly matched fighters have laid it all out on the line. Let's see who can get the job done as we get to the end of the fight. Ooh, blocks the shot. Under three minutes now to go round five. Just misses with the jet. Not there. Right at the elbow. Oh, big roundhouse attempt. Just misses. 
he lands a punch there. Pretty good connection by him. Oh, nice connection by him there. He needs to get on his bicycle, John. He needs to get into space so that he doesn't get finished. Still stand. I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. And it might not be over now, but it's gonna be over very soon. You take more of these leg kicks, you will not be able to be very active on your feet. Connects with a right hand, pretty good punch that one. Nice right punch by this young man. Well, if you like Muay Thai striking, this might be your moment in this fight as he gets the tie clinch. This is a massive moment for this fighter. He is a great Muay Thai fighter. Look for him to go knee-knee and then try to land a big one to the head. Just out of range with the straight left hand. Oh! He blocks the punch. Beautifully placed in time kick there by Lee. What a fight! All right, the official decision is now in. Here is Bruce Buff. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. All three judges score this contest. 48-47. For the winner, by unanimous decision, Bruce the Dragon! Lee! All right, so the judges are in agreement tonight. He is your winner by unanimous decision. Certainly a pretty easy fight to score, I thought. Yeah, I thought it was an easy fight to score. Whereas his opponent had a few moments, he was the one that truly did lead all the interactions. He's the person that truly did dictate the fight.